Well, happy Sabbath to all. Again, we are back and Julius is not here, but next Sabbath she will be with us again for the next program and we'll continue talking about faith, love, joy, happiness, and family. We will continue lifting up the name of Jesus. You know, when you think about what is taking place in the world today, you, you wonder what is happening. And then all we can think about, the signs of the times are all around us. Our Lord Jesus Christ, He is coming again. And the Bible talks about the end time and signs and, you know, you will see all these things come to pass. And when you see these things, what to do? Look up. Put your faith and trust in God. Don't worry about a lot of what is taking place today. Just trust Him. And I want to encourage you, my friends, my brothers and sisters, my family, folks who are listening for the first time. Put your faith in God. Love Him with all your heart, soul, and mind. And love your neighbors as you love yourself. Now it's time to wrap up with your loved ones. Now it's time to love everyone. Now it's not time to hate and gossip and cheat and bad talk and criticize. Now it's not time for those things. Now it's time to get ready. And I don't want to get ready, but stay ready. Now it's time to study the Word and see what God Word says about these last days, the things that has taken place in our world. Open the Word of God and see what God wants you to do. Trust Him, love Him. As my favorite text, it says, Seek Him first. Seek Him first, the kingdom of God. Now it's time to love everyone. So I want you to put your faith, put your trust in God. In these last days, the signs are all around us. Very soon, the King of kings and Lord of lords will come to take you and to take me. So all the wars and the rumors, wars and the earthquakes and the flooding and the volcanoes, all those things, end time, signs and the end time. But I want you to know something, that if you put your faith in God, trust in God, that He will take care of you. Put your faith, your, your whole faith in Him. He will give you the power. He will give you the victory over sin. You don't have to worry. You can go, go to bed and sleep like a baby because you put your faith and trust in God, the one who made you in his own image. He loves you. And he died on the cross of Calvary for you and me. So, don't get scared. Don't get frightened. Oh, you know, Everything will be all right. He will, even the suffering, the suffering will come, you know, the heart problems and all those things will come, but that's okay. You have your faith in God that He will look over you. He'll watch over you. He will take care of you and your loved ones, your family. So remember, these are the last days we are living in. This is the end time. Put your faith in Christ. So don't fight back. Don't argue back. Don't get upset and angry. Just believe that God is in control of this world. The signs of the times are fulfilling all around us. Human being is very important. Because you see, Jesus died for sinners. And we all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. So Jesus Christ, he loved everyone. And he wants you to do the same too. He wants you to love him. And he wants you to love his people. Love your wife, your children, your enemies. Love you, folks who walk out of your life and folks who, who did wrong to you. Love them. 
Love them because a time is coming that Jesus will come again and put an end to sin and suffering. There'll be no more war, no more death, no more suffering, no more pain. I look forward for that beautiful day. All about you. Look forward to talking to you next week with journeys. God bless and you have a blessed weekend.